Ozzy, the world's oldest male gorilla was found dead at Zoo Atlanta on Tuesday. He was 61 years old. The primate had tested positive for COVID-19 last year along with a group of other gorillas, however, it's unknown if the sickness led to his eventual passing. While we knew this time would come someday, that inevitability does nothing to stem the deep sadness we feel at losing a legend, said President and CEO Raymond B. King, Ozzy's life's contributions are indelible, in the generations of individuals he leaves behind in the gorilla population and in the world's body of knowledge in the care of his species. Our thoughts are with his care team, who have lost a part of their lives and a part of their hearts. Zuvets had noticed that Ozzy seemed to be losing his appetite last week, however, he was still encouraged to eat and drink. Last September, Ozzy and at least eight other gorillas at Zoo Atlanta tested positive for COVID. The animals faced similar symptoms to humans such as runny noses, coughing and sneezing. Ozzy first arrived at the zoo in 1988. In 2009, he helped achieve a scientific milestone when he became the first gorilla to receive a blood pressure reading. He was 48 years old at the time and was considered geriatric.